It's been a super long season with indoor and outdoor, but it's definitely been really fun. We've had a, a really solid outdoor season. We've got several people qualified for the conference championships this weekend, and we have someone represented in every running event on the track, which is pretty special. We have several women who can potentially score or even possibly win their events. Um, so I think that will elevate our team to hopefully a bit higher position at the end of the second day than we've been in previous years. One of the highlights definitely was the home meet that we had in the end of April because it is really great to run at McAllister because I get all these friends coming over and cheering for us and we did really well in our relays in 4x1 and 4x4. The home meet is always really fun. We had a really good uh, 10k performance from Anna Schmitz. That was her first time running the 10k and she won by like, she lapped everyone and won, so it was really good. When we get up into those longer distance races, that's where we should score again as well with Kimber and Anna. Of course, I'm excited to see Kimber run. She's gonna be really fast. We've got two very good steeplechasers, Sarah Jonathan and Becky Kane, who both have potential to score at the meet. And then our middle distance, our, you know, our strongest middle distance runner is Irene Gibson, and she's historically done quite well in the conference championship meets. I first will say that I love the 4x4, four four and I'm really sad to leave, but I'm really excited because we have at least four or five women that will still be able to run that next year and run a really good time. We definitely have some promising first-year women in our program. Heather Bourne and, and Sarah Silbert are two excellent um, jumpers. They've got an incredible coach in Amanda Smock, who you know is an Olympian triple jumper, so that's very encouraging. Megan Clapper's done really well for us in the high jump, um, another first-year athlete, and then we have Simone, one of our junior captains that's, that will compete in the javelin. We're encouraged by the youth in our program, we certainly need to get stronger in the field events because if you're ever going to be a viable track and field program, you need to be balanced, but it's tough. Our conference is very competitive. Um, we've got a good team. I, I'm, I'm pretty excited about the program as it is and we'll continue to get better.